What's up, guys? <clears throat> this is going to be episode two of the Maple Leafs general manager mode. Franchise mode, same thing. So, in the last episode, we went over our roster, and I guess I didn't save it. So, I mean, um, William Nylander, I brought him up in that episode. Uh, he's going to stay in the AHL for now. Actually, we're just going to bring him up now. But I believe he's going to be scratched until we need to possibly replace him with somebody. So we're going to have to send somebody down here. But yeah, I guess I didn't save it. So I mean, so we're going to send uh Seth Griffith if that's it. Let's see, is that his name? Yep. Okay. So we're going to have to we're going to be sending him down and then we're going to bring up Marner. So we brought up Mitchell Marner. And he's just going to be scratched for the time being. Um, I mean, so we're going to look at our lines. Because this episode, we're going to start the simulation. Start year one. Uh, possibly finish year one. I'm not sure. but So here are the lines right now. I put Nylander on that line to balance out the third line. And then Matt Martin on the fourth line to balance out the fourth line. So it wasn't 80, 80, and 80. This one's 81, 85, and 80. The uh, fourth line's 80, 80, and 81. So I think that uh, with Kadri and Brooks like on the same line as Nylander, they can do. Nylander can get the experience and possibly get a boosting and a overall or something. So Hunwick and Carrick, I switched those two last episode. So that's what we're gonna keep, and then we're gonna go to our goalies. I'm gonna pull a trade, hopefully. So Frederick Anderson, I don't know why he's not starting, but that's okay. So I have a guy in mind um, for who's gonna be. Um, our starter if we can trade for him and I'll just pull him up in the trades I think he would be a great addition to our team as he was to the team that he's on which I don't want to give it away yet Martin Jones we're gonna try and get Martin Jones because I like how he, he's pretty solid in that he's an 87 overall he's got a lot of trade value and he's only 26 so we're going to try and get unload Frederick Anderson, and that might go straight up. So if it does, I'm going to see if we can possibly get something else out of it. Um, just, just so we could possibly uh, get something here, possibly. I'm not sure. We're going to be at... Uh, Mar uh, Nieto is a guy that I would like on my team. Uh, we'd have more than, we'd have too many skaters. So we're just going to see if we can add something cheap here. So we're going to see if we can just get rid of, wait, he's a left. Let's see, was he a left winger? He was, so you know, that means I'm going to be trying to unload. Um, Martin or like. I'm going to say, well, Brooks Like is only 33. I mean, his overall is only an 81. But he's had some experience. But Martin, I mean, I don't know what I should do. I might try and get rid of Brooks Like, but I also don't know. Yeah, that's who we're going to try and unload here. So we're going to see if this trade goes through to San Jose. And it doesn't. So Brooks like is not somebody they're interested in. Other than that, they liked the deal. So let me see if I can unload um, Martin. Because there's two guys that they would like. And it's accepted. So we got Martin Jones for Frederick Anderson. It might not be the best deal, but I think it's going to be more beneficial for us. And we got um, um, Nieto, who's made a big impact on the Avalanche this year. He scored a ton of goals, and I know it might not happen now. But we're going to see what we can do. Mm, why does it want me to send... We're going to have to send somebody down here. So I'm going to give... Um, Oh, no, I'm not. No, he's not going down. Um, 
so I don't know who to move down. Corrado. Okay. So we're going to go to edit lines and we're going to put um, Nieto. Uh, I guess he's going to be playing right wing. I mean, this team's like they have left wingers on. Oh, he is scratched. So I'm going to substitute in all lines just so he can fill the line errors. Oh, we got to dress. Gotta dress Jones. Martin Jones. It's a pretty solid goalie, so I think he'd be beneficial for my, my team, uh, other than Frederick Anderson. So, this is how our team's gonna be for the first uh, few, maybe two months or so. So, we got Van Riemsdyk, Pol uh, Bozak, and McCulloch. Then Lupul, Matthews, and Makomarov. Then Brooks, like Nazem Kadri, and William Nylander. And then Greening, Holland, and Nieto. So Nieto, on let's see. So he's his stats are not terrible. He 2015-16, uh, 67 games. So he's only nine, eight goals and nine assists. But he gets he can get those points up. And I think he'll be able to do that with and try and get Holland and Greening to go, get going. So we're gonna start the simulation. Um, so yeah, that's how we're gonna get. That's how we're gonna start off. 89 offense, 90 defense, and 89 goalie. Uh, 89 goalie um, average. So yeah, we sim through preseason. So we're gonna go into gonna go to December first. So we're at Ottawa to start the year, and we win there five to two. So, I mean, that's a good start. I know it's only one game. We just got to keep these wins going and build a solid record for us as we beat Boston in our shootout. And I'm going to actually edit scouting assignment. We're going to have him scout in the WHL. Forwards, yes, we need some forwards on that for third and fourth line. Unless, these, unless if guys don't start going up in overalls, we're going to have to try and... Yeah, but 2-0 to start the year. I mean, Connor Carrick... Getting more ice time. We got creamed by Winnipeg. And then we beat Minnesota. Chicago's a tough team for us here. As we lost in a shootout. We do get a point out of that. And that point could help us in the long stretch at the uh, end of the year. Tampa Bay. We beat Tampa Bay. And then Florida. Here's a promotion night. And we lose on a promotion night by one. Ah, those one goal games are going to kill us this year if we keep losing like that. And then Montreal, we beat Montreal 5-2. to two. Then we lost to the Islanders. That's, I mean, come on. It's going to be a, weak, a bit weaker than normal. Okay. Versus Edmonton, win. We just got to keep these wins going all this month. And Martin Jones, I hope, I'm going to check his stats. Uh, after the simulation, we lost to Buffalo 3-0. And we beat Vancouver. They're not having the greatest start to the season. There's versus LA. We beat LA by one. And Philadelphia and Pittsburgh. Those are going to be tough teams for us. Philadelphia's not off to the best start. And we do beat them 3-2. And Pittsburgh also is not off to the best start. And we beat them. We beat Philadelphia and Pittsburgh back to back. That's that's good. And we win. Dang. I'm wow. We beat uh, Nashville six nothing, and then we beat Florida three nothing on another promotion night at Montreal. Those games are gonna be tough in the Bell Center. And we beat them. We beat them four to one. Dang. Ah, we lose to Carolina. Dang, we had a pretty good stretch going, and we beat New Jersey in a shootout. We're 14-5-1 and on the 26th of November, at, and we're playing Washington. Uh, their records are really, really good, 16-4-1. and And we lose in a shootout. We do get a point out of that. So we're going to be at Edmonton, at Calgary, then at Vancouver. Um, okay, so we're going to see what we can do 
and these two games right here back to back in Canada overtime win and then we lose to Calgary 5 to 3 so there's the end of uh, November so we're getting into December I'm gonna sim up to the Vancouver game so in December we have Vancouver Minnesota Boston Colorado twice San Jose Arizona twice Pittsburgh Anaheim Florida again and Tampa Bay so we're gonna go look at where we are and how our team's doing okay so right now we're on top of it we're on top right now with 32 points three points ahead of uh, Tampa Bay and so this is gonna be it's gonna be a close division as of now so we're gonna go look at some stats because I think that's all the simulation we're gonna do is what is that about in a month or so maybe we'll send December too but we're gonna go to um, at central we've had a pretty good start to the year um we're gonna look at our player stats here okay so who's leading our team in goals van reamsteik is leading our team with goals at 17 and then who's leading our team in assists tyler bozak with 18 and then points van reamsteik leading nice nice that's good and then we're gonna look at our goalies i'm gonna see how they're doing so martin jones has two shutouts um, already in 19 games played he's 12 and 5 and then Enroth's 3 and 1 um, goals against yeah save percentage for Jones is 0.926 that's pretty good Enroth 0.872 he can get that up doesn't play as much two shutouts for um, Jones and so we're gonna go look at how Frederick Anderson is and see how it's going for him in San Jose so he's 13 and 8 um, he has a .911 save percentage. Um, he has one shutout. So, I mean, both guys are doing decent at their new teams. Um, so, yeah. So, there's the stats for now. Um, we're going to go back, and we're going to sim December. Um, so, hopefully we can keep this up as, as we go through December. We're going to sim into January. So, we play... I think, think we play a Centennial Classic on January 1st against Detroit, possibly. So at Vancouver, that's the team we're going to have to beat this year, and we did. Because they, they're not the best, and we got to keep rolling over them. Got to keep rolling over quite a few teams if we want to stay on top of this division. Especially Boston, since they're a division team, and we lose to Minnesota. I would like to beat Minnesota. So we're at Boston here, TD Garden. And we lose 2-1. to one. See, those one-goal games are going to kill us. So he's got Colorado, San Jose. We beat Colorado 5-2. to two. Here's San Jose. I would like to beat them. And we lose 3-1. to one. And Jonas Enroth got the loss there. So we're versus Arizona. We beat Arizona. That's, that's good. Pittsburgh. We beat Pittsburgh last time we played them. That was the beginning of the year. And they've stepped it up. We beat Pittsburgh 2-1. to one. That's a big win. 19-9-2. We just got to keep winning these games here. Anaheim. We lose in overtime, but we get a point out of that. So points are going to be huge this year. Uh, we're at Colorado there. We lose 3-1. to one. That's okay. And we lose to Arizona, but we get a point out of that one too. So we're 19-10-4 on December 26th. Now the 27th. Our AHL team's not doing the best. They're close to 500. Here's at Florida and then at Tampa Bay. Shootout win against Florida. And Tampa Bay is going to be a team we have to beat. And we lose to them. That's that's a bad loss right there. we got to beat Tampa Bay. Because they've been on our tail. They, they're going to be on our tails the whole, a lot this year. So we're going to go look. I believe Tampa Bay um, probably passed us. Yeah, we dropped uh, two places. We're one point behind Boston. And then Tampa Bay is going to start running away with that lead. And Florida is only one point behind us. So if we drop to Florida, then we're going to end up at um, the wild card position. So, I mean, we're going to hold a team meeting before the game against Detroit. And we can see what we need to do here. Everybody needs to go above and beyond tonight. We need to win in a dominant fashion. Play smart, play with passion, play our game, boys. Don't let emotion overcome you. I like that one. And I don't know why people didn't like that, but okay. 
Okay, so there's the simula- we're gonna- that's all we're gonna simulate in this episode. Um, I don't think- I don't know, we have had a decent year right now. So we're gonna look at our stadium here. We're gonna upgrade, we got 25 days left of that, just so we can get that fan happiness up, because we need fans here. <laughs> So we're 2011 and four on January 1st. Um, one point behind Boston for second place, and then we're eight points behind Tampa Bay for that first spot. And we're only one point ahead of Florida, and they're closing in on us. So yeah. Um, so yeah, we got 35 games simmed through this episode. We're 2011 and four. So I think that's what we're gonna. That's we started year one. We made a trade for the goalie position. So yeah. Um, this is that's it for this episode. Uh, another one will be coming out shortly, so enjoy your guys. Enjoy your day, guys.